Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am here with another plan with me. This time I'm in my household planner for my B6. No, I'm in my B6 for my household. I'm in my B6 planner for my household. <laughs> Whatever, I'm here, I'm here, okay? All right, let's take a look at this past week. Um, I'm gonna tell you guys something. The way that I laid this out, I really enjoyed it. So that, that's not it. Here we go. Yes, this without having any real white space. Oh my gosh, it helped out so much. I have no idea what I was going to put here. I just put it down and I really had no idea what I was going to use the habit trackers for, but knowing what I was going to eat for dinner and having the checklist, oh my gosh, it helped out so much, so much. You guys, you have no idea. Um, so I am going to, I haven't put down like what Steve's thing is. So this is probably just going to be an empty column for now. Um, unless things come up later today, uh, that we need to do, but all of our chores have been done for the day. Um, minus laundry day. I don't think laundry is going to happen today. I just put it down. It's probably going to happen sometime this upcoming week. And then obviously Sunday is there. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I'm going to use this kit from River and Ink and then... I'm also going to pull in, I need to reach over here and grab everything. I haven't, I haven't filed away everything just yet. Um, but yeah, I'm going to need those stickers here. And then we have the bundles for our functionals, um, the set two functionals. And I was going to bring these in because I think this is gonna match really, really well. So I'm just gonna, I got a, I got a big mama jamma stack right here because I don't know what I'm gonna pull in. And then I dropped some washi down here. Yeah, I don't need that washi because um, the green doesn't match here, so. Okay, so we're gonna do very much like what we did in this last spread but because duh, 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 um i'm just trying to think yeah so not gonna need any bottom washi so we're gonna put that off for now and we're going to we're gonna use these um and yeah there's date covers and i have glitter headers okay perfect so all right yeah i really loved the way that everything um came together for this last um, week. And so I really kind of I'm like, oh, did I just find my, did I just find my layout? Please tell me I did, because <laughs> that would be amazing. All right, so I am not as far ahead in this planner, nor my 52 weeks planner. And I was talking about this in my last video, that I am getting pretty far ahead in my seven by nine and my weeks planner. So those those two planners, because I reveal the mystery kit and I reveal the next month's monthly functional sub on top of doing a, a different plan with me, which, you know, that's just kind of how I've liked it. Like doing it, I am a few weeks ahead and I'm just getting further and further ahead that for those, I may be able to take a week off for like when it comes time to move um, and stuff and then still be, still be really on track to do everything. However, I'm not ahead in this planner and I'm not ahead in my 52 weeks planner. So I'm also thinking that one of these weeks I do, um, instead of my normal weeks and seven by nine spreads. I just don't do videos for those weeks. And I do a couple extra videos for the 52 weeks and this planner and get us ahead because there are, as we've discussed, I really try to keep on topic to the planner that I'm utilizing. Um, we have on this channel, we have discussed how, you know, there's going to be things happening and how we are going to need to utilize as much organization as possible in order to make this move successful. So I think if I do take some time, especially like maybe next week, um, of having, um, getting ahead on some of these spreads, 
it's going to, I'm going to be able to take it and actually write things down ahead of time for certain days that are going to happen for certain things that are definitely going to happen. Uh, yeah, let's use, let's use this one. Whoa, that was crazy. Okay. Put you back. Let's make sure that you didn't get there. Okay. So every once in a while, silhouettes like to like skip. Um, it it happens to to everyone. Um, it just I don't know what like silhouettes problem is. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lay this down here so I can see that it's got like a perforated cut line, um, but it's really hard to cut through that so I'm going to use my slice tool and stuff so that's why they invented these tools so that we could you know where's my tweezers I don't have any nails so it's really hard for me to get up there yeah see it was it just had this perforated line that wasn't all the way through sometimes I, and I can tell you from experience Every once in a while, sometimes when it's supposed to cut a straight line, they will go absolutely nuts and decide to do what they want to do. And we'll, I've had that happen where it's got like this perforated cut line. It's super, super weird. I don't know why it does it. I've never been able to figure out. It's not a big deal. And just move along and, and stop. Okay. So, like I said, there's some very, very specific things that are going to be happening. Um, God, I wish she had more of these. I wish I had more of them, but I don't. Okay, it's fine. I'm going to go just down the line. I'm going to alternate with the glitter headers because I think it would be nice to have that. And then we'll do our chore list and I'll pull out my three spot checklist. Yes, I know I have four kids and I try to put like one of their chores there, but I think I'm just gonna really do it for the things that need to be done that day. Cause not always do we have dishes every single day. So we've all heard the debacle and I absolutely hate this, hate that we do this. So I only like to really use paper plates and silverware. Um, during like big barbecues and cookouts and even sometimes then it depends on who's over sometimes it's just easier yeah we are in the midst of utilizing paper plates and disposable silverware because the dishwasher does not want to work and we are starting to purge so um dishes don't always have to be done every every night sometimes there's only like two dishes in there as well because my kids don't use cups anymore probably like how does that happen okay my kids use something called a hydration tool uh, we do not uh it's something my husband learned when he was in um, as a drill instructor that you don't water bottles get thrown away water bottles get um whatchamacallit water bottles don't get used water bottles get thrown away i can't count and talk at the same time apparently so we use something called a hydration tool and so they all have reusable um water hydration tools and they you know we wash them out and let them dry because we have a drying rack right there and they fill them right back up so very rarely is a cup used in this house because we have hydration tools um, and it's actually been a very, very successful thing. They're in charge of where's your hydration tool. We don't call it a water bottle because water bottles are meant to get lost and water bottles are meant to be thrown away. And it's a hydration tool and it has been the saving grace. It has cut down on so many dishes, um, and stuff. So yeah, call it a hydration tool. All right. Oh, you know what I could use? Cause these have little checklists in here. <gasps> I could use the sticky notes. I think I'm going to do that. Okay. I need to look at the colors here and I need to make sure that I'm getting as close to the colors as possible. So I definitely think this pink is going to be it. So we're going to pull 
then I'm, the pinks off. Okay, I might, you know what? Just pull all the pinks off. Okay, the purples, no. My shades of purples are way too different. The blues, most definitely. Uh, greens, way too different of shades. The yellow, mm, maybe the more pale yellow, I think. We're gonna pull it off to the side, okay? Uh, the orange, most definitely, because that works as well, and not the red, okay. See, I just needed to go through those to see, to make sure that I had like really great colors. Okay, so, hmm, what should I utilize? Because if I utilize, if I utilize these, they have little check boxes and I can write the chores that need to be done, but that's a lot of, okay, we're gonna go with the three spot checklist, you guys. We're gonna go with the three spot checklist. That is, as much as I wanna do that, I also don't wanna have to write that small. So we're gonna go with the three spot checklist. Um, and I'm going to have to kind of do this in batches here to ensure that one, I don't miss anything, but I'm not also like screwing up my um, order either. So, oh yeah, this is going to look good. So good. So, all right. So I hate that I'm having to utilize uh, paper plates right now, but I mean, it kind of is what it is. We're in the midst of a, what pink did I need to use? I can't even remember what pink color I was going to use. I just knew that it was going to be a good pink. Um, should I go with the darker? No, I'm almost thinking going with the lighter pink. It's not quite... Yeah, we're going to go with the lighter pink. Or the mid-range pink, I should say. That's what we'll go with. Okay, so chores there. And then we start all over again. <laughs> I didn't think this one through, did I? All right. Uh, there we go. And we have the orange. So I'm ready to... I'm ready to have a dishwasher back, you guys. So ready to have a dishwasher back. Oh. So the house that we are currently looking to buy... And I say looking to buy because even at the very last moment, things can go wrong. So it's not our house yet. But the house we are currently under contract for has two dishwashers. I mean, I hold up three, but two dishwashers. There we go. It has two dishwashers. I Honestly, I really don't even know what to think about that. Like, how does that even happen? How does one get two dishwashers? I've never had two dishwashers in my life. Okay, I have had two dishwashers, but they're called kids. Um, that is what I have had. So I'm kind of like, what does this mean? How does this work? So, okay, let's go ahead and put the full boxes down at the bottom so that, let's see, four. Okay, we're gonna go pattern and then like, scene type pictures that's what we're gonna do so I mean yeah I my, my kids are my dishwashers that's that's what that's the kind of dishwashers I've had um, so I don't know really what to make of this but I'm really excited and I'm but I do know that I don't want this to be a whim of a move either like I don't want to be like oh let's just start throwing things in boxes and doing stuff here so I do have to I guess this is my roundabout way of saying I do have to like pre-plan some more in this planner so that I can start writing some specifics down so I guess this didn't work out the way that I wanted it to work out I thought I had Oh, I know why. Because I was classifying that one as a pattern. So, oh well. It's fine because these two end up on the weekend. So it works for me. Works for me. Alright. Um, I don't want to pull that one off because that was on the same side as that last one that I ended up having to use a slice tool with. 
does this. Yep, there's that little perforation happening. Sometimes, sometimes it just happens when you have a uh, piece of sticker paper stuck to your blade and it can't quite go all the way through. It just kind of skips. It's such a weird thing. Love silhouettes, but man, sometimes they're just weird. Okay, let's see. I want to make sure. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put glitter headers down here to really separate everything off again. And I just kind of have to think a little bit deeper on on this um, because it is it is the household planner and while we do have I mean I just need to kind of operate my house like a business don't I just need to start putting things down and telling people what to do um, except the people that work for me don't like to listen to me aka my children they don't they don't like they don't like to listen so how how do I how do I fix that one did I go in order? Okay, I did. Whew. I was, I was like, I think I just messed up. But nope, I didn't. Yay! Okay, we're going to do the stack. Sticky notes off to the side in Steve's column because one, I think that's adorable. And two, it just makes things... I don't have to think so hard about things to put in, in there. So, stack sticky notes for stack, topsy-turvy, tipsy-turvy... You know what, Stephanie, if you're watching this, we're going to call this the Tipsy Turvy Stack, okay? So, Stephanie from Tipsy Dogs Designs, she's the one who does this, um, but I'm coining it, I'm bringing it in for a phrase, and it is going to be called the Tipsy Turvy Design, okay? All right, Tipsy Turvy Stack is what it is. That's what we're going to call it, Tipsy Turvy Stack. Remember that, because I will probably totally forget come next week. Tipsy Turvy Stack, okay. There are no bills to be paid this week, so I don't need to do any of that. And there is no payday this week. So we do not have, okay, we need to, we need the clean and we need the trash. And I will take the dishes for one day. Um, we need the laundry. Ah, heck, I'll take the other clean as well. We'll clean at the beginning of the week and we'll clean at the end of the week. How does that sound? Does that work for everybody? Okay, don't need any of that stuff. We don't do recycle down here in this, the, the city that I'm in. And then we'll do the weekend banner, which, come on. There we go. We'll do the weekend banner. Okay, let's get these all down and then I'm going to kind of go a little bit day by day so not so much I try to do more throughout the week than leaving it for the weekend but you know it is what it is we start going back to swimming lessons at our friend's house that day um, let's see probably going to need to do laundry this day oh my gosh she does have more of these I was saying I wish she had more of these and she did I could have layered those up there to put the chores in oh, man batting a thousand here not doing not doing great so let's pull this out and we're gonna put this down here and we're gonna mark laundry day so we still can't use our washer because everything we're into AC season now because we live so far so far south and every time I've gone back there I have to make sure that the water isn't uh, the AC isn't running and so we have just opted to just not use our washer which is sad um, because it's just one more thing like we have to go do so the boys go to the laundromat on Wednesdays we get it all done and we're just good to go like it's just done um, and in this point in time, it's just what works well for us. Okay, so um, no, I don't want colors close together. So this is going to be take out trash. Um, this one is going to be a take out trash. Um, and then trash day is on Wednesday. 
and Saturday. So I just do need to make sure that I get this up and going and we will put, I mean, there's going to be more days where there's, where there's dishes, but um, we'll put those for now. And then Saturday is also a trash day. I don't have another trash sticker, so I'm going to have to write it, which we all know I don't really like to do that. And I like to lay stickers down crooked. Okay, so we do have trash day. Okay, let's see what else we have. Do, 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 do. And I need to make sure that we have no white space or I'm not going to utilize this spread for all that it's worth. So I'll go ahead and put down these half stickers and I will I might take out trash script. I thought I had another one, but I guess I don't or I misplaced it. Because I used these scripts last week, but okay. Alright, take out trash. And take out trash. So that's going to mark who took out the trash. I did like doing that so that I could see who I'm asking to um, take out the trash. And then versus who takes out the trash to the curb. So I'm just going to fill this all in. And then I... I'm wondering what to put in between these areas. Like I said, the having the having stickers down as weird as this sounds, okay? Oh, I don't want to do do I want to do blue? Yeah, I'll do blue. It'll be fine. I don't mind too much. Having a sticker down then means that I actually have to like place something there. Like I have to really be like, okay, we have to put something down. Um, so, okay, I did enjoy tracking dinners, so I'm going to do the same, but I don't have, nope, I don't have a script or anything to mark for dinners. So we'll put that there, and then I have these two boxes, which, and then we'll put a divider between them. Don't ask me what they're for. I don't know what they're for yet. Um, they may not even ever get filled out. But it's just utilizing the space for now as I'm navigating this whole new world of things going on. Okay, so we have that. I'm not going to use any habit trackers. But how many How many boxes do we have left? Okay, we have we have some boxes. Let's let's utilize these. Let's utilize these guys. So I'm gonna take all of these because I don't need. Like I said, I'm just wanting to fill in the space because then I'll be more likely. Because that's the thing that I think has killed me over in like some of these areas is having this white space. I'm like, oh, there's nothing that I need to do. We all know how wrong I am about that. So I just definitely want to, after last week and knowing how well everything worked with having all of that space filled in, I was definitely like, yeah, this, this needs to, this needs to happen more. So, we're just going to put one here, things like this, and then we have this extra box here, and then we have this. Okay, this works out, this has turned out really, really good. I like it. I like it. So, the Tipsy Turvy Stack, we have all of that. And we have this. Okay, so we have chores that need to get done, but then we have extra space. Like I said, I have four kids, so obviously I need like four spots to do chores. But some of the kids have more chores, so this works out really, really well. I like it. I like it. And I got to use my functionals. I mean, come on. 
Could you get any better than that? I don't think so. I don't think so. All right, so let me just kind of clean up here. I'm not gonna utilize the note pages right now because I just don't know what I need to put in there. And that's okay with me, I'm okay with that. So I'm moving all this stuff out of the way and let's take a look. Oh, it looks adorable, yes. So yes, I think this will work out much better than having a whole bunch of white space in between here going, oh, you need to fill this out because that just kind of isn't how my brain works. So, all right, I'm pretty happy with it. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, everything will be linked down in the description box below, like always. And if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Leave us a comment down below. And as always, stay happy, stay healthy, and stay safe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye now.